Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Chattel Matter. If you don't know who I am, I create natural hair and lifestyle content. Just off the bat, I still live in the same noisy apartment that I lived in in my previous video. So you may hear cars passing on the road, but I won't get this video done if I wait for a quiet moment. Um, and so I am here with a first impressions video. You may be familiar with the brand for skincare items and not hair care. However, I think they just came up with two hair care products. And so I wanted to try it on my type 4 hair and give you guys a review of how these products work on natural hair. That being said, I've only used the products twice a piece. And so this is a first impressions and not a full review. So uh, this brand that I'm speaking of is The Ordinary. The Ordinary came out with a sulfate 4% cleanser for body and hair. And they also came out with a Behendrimonium Chloride 2% conditioner. And it says it's a lightweight conditioning formula. So let's talk cost right off the bat. The products are priced right about the £7 mark. I am going to confirm that and put the correct price in the description box as well as on the screen. But if my memory serves me correct, they were about £7 a piece. So that is in the lowest end of products that I've seen here in the UK, but it's also not the highest end. You would typically find your Camille Rose Naturals, they're about the £10, £13 range and so this serves as the middle ground for me it's quite average in price and so i thought that it wasn't robbery to purchase from them as you guys can see the packaging is quite minimalistic very much in keeping with all of the other ordinary product packaging i quite love it i love the square bottle it looks high-end to me i think the packaging is almost is part of what got me and got me to spend my coin <laughs> um i quite like it um the bottle is matte i love the tops i love the print just love everything about the packaging and also i feel like the packaging is suitable for the products the product consistency the conditioner is not super super runny but it's also not very viscous and so it easily passes through the squeeze bottle and it's the same thing for the shampoo so i feel like the packaging corresponds with the consistency of the product so for packaging i would give them a thumbs up the third criterion that i like to evaluate my products on are the claims that the product makes um in terms of claims the ordinary does not make any elaborate extravagant claims um the, it simply says for the shampoo that it's a gentle cleansing formula for daily use and in terms of directions, it says to work the cleanser into wet hair and body and rinse. Well, it also says it's formulated to remove skin and scalp buildup and it's fragrance free. That's all it says. So there aren't very many claims to evaluate the product on. For the most part, what it says is true. I don't use the shampoo daily because hello, this is natural hair, black girl, hello. We don't shampoo daily. But also, even if I did shampoo daily, I'm not certain that I would use this product to shampoo daily. While the product is not super, super stripping, it is a thorough cleanser. As it says, it removes buildup. And so it has this clarifying-esque 
behavior that works really well for me because i do not love these shampoos that leave the sebum on the the roots of my hair or leave my scalp dirty um i feel like this product did a good job of clarifying my hair without stripping it and making it super 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 dry um, but it does clarify your hair you will feel like some of the oils have been removed which is what you want when you want that clean wash so i wouldn't use this every day um, on black hair but it does do everything else that it says and it is a good product i actually quite like the shampoo something to note as with many shampoos it does not lather very much when your hair is dirty it lathers a lot more when your hair is cleaner which is great but even when it lathers a lot more its lather is not super super great um, but it does lather and it does feel good um, and it does clarify <music> that the conditioner makes it says that it's a lightweight conditioning formula um it the directions say to work the conditioner into wet hair rinse very simple love that um, and it says behind trimonium chloride two percent conditioner offers conditioning and smoothing benefits to the hair again it's fragrance free again very minimal claims and I must agree with all of the claims. You guys, I actually really, really enjoyed this conditioner. I, of course, used the products on heat damaged hair, as you can see in the demonstration. But I could feel the conditioning effect on the roots of my hair, which are natural and my true texture. It reminded me of the Giovanni Direct Living. If you guys were in the original natural hair gang that was a holy grail product a stable product for most naturals the consistency reminds me of it as well as the feel except that was a leave-in conditioner and this one is a rinse out conditioner this has great sleep i find really really good sleep so it's black girl friendly if you ask me um and with my heat damaged hair while it is looser it tangles a lot more um, and this did a good job of helping me detangle one other thing to note about the products the shampoo in particular says that it is dual purposed so it is a shampoo for hair but it's also a body cleanser do i like these two in one products no i don't i'm the kind of person who likes specialized products for specialized things i hate the idea of using dual purposed products but I did try it as a body wash. It actually feels very silky smooth um, and it doesn't dry out the skin at all. But I don't think that going forward, I will continue to use it as a body wash because it's just simply me. I have the body washes that I want to use, um, that I enjoy, and I'm going to keep these as just hair products. This is pretty much it on the ordinary products. Please let me know in the comment section if you even knew that The Ordinary had hair care products. 
um, and if you're new have you tried those products so guys thank you for watching don't forget to like don't forget to share the video and of course leave your comments down in the comment section i will see you in the next one i have quite a few videos on backlog so one is a wash and go um with heat damage hair before this cut um, and i also did a cut before i did this one a maintenance cut um, and i tried to record that so if the footage is good that video should be coming out as well uh, so look out for these two videos before i come and update you on my hair and what's happening with it but i will see you in the next few videos my crown so heavy, better help me carry. My crown so heavy, better help me carry. My crown so heavy, crown so heavy. My crown so heavy.